How do we abide in Christ? Pruning Those who have tried their hand at gardening will know that pruning is when plants are cut off or cut back to encourage more growth. Jesus is the vine, we are the branches, and the Father is the vine dresser or the gardener. He is the one who cuts back the branches that do not produce any fruit. For those branches that do produce fruit, he prunes back further so that they will be even more fruitful. John 15 verse 1 2 This means that believers will experience painful times in their life. However, the Lord can use it to remove anything that is hindering our spiritual growth. It will result in greater flourishing for us as we walk with Him. The life of the plant occurs when it is attached to its source. The branches are dependent on remaining in the conditions to best encourage its growth. Psalm 1 illustrates this point by describing a person who delights in God's Word as being like a tree planted by streams of water which yields its fruit in season and whose leaf does not wither. Whatever they do prospers. Jesus, the Word of God, is the vine who is also described as light of the world. He gives us living water by His Spirit. John 7 verse 37 39 And He gives the breath of life, Genesis 2 verse 7. He is the one for whom all things were created and everything is sustained by the word of His power. Colossians 1 verse 16 Hebrews 1 verse 3 Just like plants need light, water and air to grow, we need all of these too, and they are found in Christ for the abundant life that God made us for. John 10 verse 10 When we abide in Jesus, we can live life to the full.